we're not in panic mode. I mean, it's easy for me to follow that pattern, but I don't think we need to be. So we'll solder it across, and run it out, and I'll cut it, so it'll have a red flag on it too. So, after the RC system's powered up, then I'll cut it. That'll be the last thing I do. So, let's cut it. Quickly and carefully get out of there. No, the nose, the nose, the nose. Come on, it's talking back towards you, John. We need more rope, more rope. Tighter on the rope. Tighter on the top rope. You got the cap move the ladder now. Tighter on the top rope. Whoa, it's going. More rope. Okay. Take up the slack on that mid rope. Mid rope, mid rope. Take the slack up on the mid rope. All the avionics are redundant, uh, the staging timers are redundant, and then we have an RC Missile Works device on top. All the electronics are G-Wizzes, the motors are Aerotex, uh, the overall height is 21.9 feet, the weight uh, ballast is, with nose weight is about 230 pounds, still should be about 6 to 1 on the takeoff, and it has no fins. Ouch.